In a beautiful palace, King Xerxes sat on his throne and governed over many provinces across the globe. One day, he decided to demonstrate his great power and wealth by holding a huge banquet for all the important men in his kingdom. Vashti, the queen, also held a banquet for the women. King Xerxes called her to come to see him because he wanted all his guests to see her beauty and admire her. But she refused to come before him and she did not want to answer the call. This greatly angered the king, who decided to look for a new queen to take Vashti's throne. When the news went out across all the provinces that the king was looking for a woman to become a new queen, Mordecai, Esther's adoptive father, said, Esther, this is your opportunity. You could be the queen. She was surprised, and for a short time, she thought that she couldn't win the crown. But Mordecai encouraged her, and so they entered the competition. Esther spent one year preparing along with many other young women, going through a very rigorous process where she learned how to dress, walk, eat, and even bathe in perfumed water like a queen of the provinces. Although there were many contestants for the crown, the favor of God was upon Esther, and King Xerxes chose her as the new queen of the Persian Empire because of her great beauty and special grace. After some time, when Haman, one of the most powerful men and closest friends of King Xerxes, realized that Mordecai didn't bow down before him and said he was a Jew, he planned to destroy the entire people of Israel. When Esther realized this and that the king had given Haman the freedom to do whatever he wanted, she proclaimed a three-day fast for all the people so that they could seek the presence of God in prayer and find favor before King Xerxes. After three days, Esther came before the king. Still astounded by her beauty, he asked, what do you want me to do for you, Esther? Without thinking twice, she asked him to protect her people Israel, to whom she belonged. And when the king realized that Haman had wanted to destroy them, he was very angry and commanded him to be removed from the kingdom. So God, through Esther, saved all the Jews, and he even crowned her with honor, respect, and love. <laughs>